Hey guys, I'm Captain Dirk and this is Frost Plunge Part 6. Um, in the last episode I made a horrible mistake and um, I set up some water to fix that uh, as the excuse. And um, I actually have drinkable water now. And uh, well, I set up most of my dwarves too. Actually, I do have some dwarves left which can still dig. And I started building some more ice walls outside here. It's uh, starting to look rather nice already, but uh, this is only the beginning. More needs to be done and more needs to be dug out and uh, I'm chilling some more. But, um, yeah, that's it for, for now, for the between post part. Um, for this episode 2, while this all this is going on in the background, I'll uh, need more migrants in the future and more miners probably too. Let's see if the they're actually getting... Drinks, uh, drinks to them now. Um, let's see, I should have some buckets and... Actually, they should be brought to the hospital and I don't have a hospital yet. So, let's set this to the, be the hospital area. And let's try and place another better two in that since I have enough sick dwarves. Also, they're the rusted corpse. I do not have a... Um, uh, corpse stockpile yet, and that's another very important one. You know what? Let's put that inside of my what's going to be my uh, outside doors area. Let's put it over here. Um, here is going to be the corpse stockpile. If a dwarf dies, he will be brought there. Um, very important. Uh, now, we'll also need coffins. Better handle this before the ghosts show up. Um, so let's make a load of coffins. Okay. Um, and well, more stuff is being done. Um, I'd what? Yeah, I'd like to see someone actually operating on the dwarves. Probably not. Um, actually, someone in the hospital now. With an injury, a leg injury. Also, did my doctor survive? He's a furnace operator. He's sleeping. He seems fine, though. Good. Okay. Um, how are my other things doing? I still have 200 drinks. I probably have yeah more than enough prepared food. Um, can't make any food until this is done, though. My plump helmets are rotting, though. Let's brew some more drinks before all those rot. Um, Okay, now what I want to do is throw, actually throw something into the cave, which is something else I wanted to do a while ago. And, um, yeah, I actually prepared a little stockpile here, I think. Let's also remove these rocks since they're in the way of the stockpile. Uh, let's also remove the hatch, but it's okay. Yeah, this is the pit pond. Now, if I set uh, something to here, it will be thrown in and... Yeah, how about we throw, just throw in a uh, kitten. Yeah. Throw in a kitten. There we go. And let him see whatever down here. We'll throw him in and while he's falling down he'll be able to see things. Like at these bottom level levels I can't see everything yet. But once the cat is thrown in, I'll... Yeah, whatever he sees while he's still falling, I'll see. And, um... Well, then I can <laughs> watch down some more. And, uh... Yeah, then he'll hit the ground and he'll, he'll die, probably die. But uh, let's see this happening. Um, here he is taking the cat, or not. Appropriate building. Inappropriate building. Someone else is going to try and do it now. No. Inappropriate building. Something wrong with that zone. Probably because of the hatch. Um... This is the lowest level. Here's the zone. Uh, let's unhide the hatch. Is the, high, the hatch locked or something? No. Well, it's built on a downstairs, and maybe that's the problem. Yeah, it probably is. And the merchants have gone too, but that's okay. Um, okay, this is the lowest level. 
do I only want to open this and uh, risk enter something flying into my fortress? Yes, I do. I want to show see what's down there. Okay, um, remove this for now, so the order will be gone to dump it into it too. Then I need to wait until that's dug out, and that might take a while with all my resting miners. Um, the only doctor is doing something. Doctor, why are you on break, doctor? We need you. You know what? You are relieved from hauling and from furnace operating for now. You need to go doctor up. Um, let's see. Outside here, it's going really slow. Wow. I completely, completely destroyed all my miners. Oh boy. Uh, well, at least these walls are being built. Um, that's something. <laughs> um, need a whole lot more to be built, but uh, it's on their way. I think I'll need to pause the video. Is the doctor actually doing something? No, that's woodcutter. And this is uh, minor one four. Doctor still on break. This is the hospital though. Yeah. Uh, hospital could use some containers too. And maybe some of the coffins are done yet. Not yet. Well, I think it's a pause video time. So, pause video it is. Ha! Huh, the doctor is actually trying something. He just needs thread. Which I don't have, and I probably did not buy from the salesman. So I have a problem. <laughs> um, thread making is tough too. Maybe if I could maybe shear one of my animals and try to turn that into thread. I don't know, but um, well, the thing is going slowly now. Um, not much else has happened. This outside zone is not moving much. Actually, there's no one next to digging, isn't there? No. One digger has given up. Oh, man. Um, you know what? I'll need to set some more. Engraver, you had a nice day, but now you will have to go and mine. Um, brewer, you should be brewing. Which he probably can't be because there's no rock pots anymore. Oh, that was still making rock crafts. Oh, well, let's make some more rock pots. Rock pots forever. Um, coffin's done. Nope. They're preferring the outside for some reason. You know what? Let's give a new order of a lot of coffins. Fucking armor stands sneaking in. And see how that happens. Um, also, let me see what might be the easiest way to make some thread. Probably something too hard, like making pigtails. Um, see you guys in a second. Okay, I uh, took a look at that and... Um, well, basically no. It basically the, uh, the answer is... Uh, I, I need to make pigtails because... Um, you could normally make some, if you had a, like a yak or an alpaca, you could probably shear them and make a thread out of the, out of the wool from that. But uh, you need animals like an yak or an alpaca for that, and I do not have one. Or a sheep, or something like that. But uh, no, don't have any of those. And, um, well, I don't have any extra pigtails lying around either, so there's no way for me to make any treads. Uh, no way to shear any creature. Let's, let's try to sh give the shear command. Some idiot probably has... Yeah, it was already cancelled. Yeah. Um, there's no nothing to shear. Um, so I get no tread, so my doctor can't operate. Well. Um, problems, problems, problems. All because I just fucked up that mining dig. I really do want to kick myself still over that. Uh, this is just recorded this after that previous video. Um, and the chicks have hatched. Nice. Oh, now since the chicks have hatched, the chicks might have actually make survive the landing. Only it's going to take ages before this tile is being dug out. Yeah. Um, 
Mr. Engraver is getting his skills up but, uh, in mining, but that'll take a while. Um, Cook. Cook can do some mining on the side. Since he's not going to be cooking anyway. Well, actually some eggs have hatched, but not all. Um, let the chicks move around for now. Uh, but the uh, problem was solved. Um, oh man, if I just bought some thread from those, those traders. That's why I usually take some thread with me in these settings uh, in the start of the well, but... Um, well, didn't do that this time because I needed more wood. And I'm hurting, but uh, that's okay. Well, it's not okay for the doors, but well, I'll get more migrants. Um, so, yeah, actually, someone's actually using the, the drink in here. It's been using a bucket, and you know, there he goes, I think. Yeah, here he goes. Let's see, Mr. It's actually the doctor. And um, he should be, yeah, give water to someone. Let's go check a little couple of down. Who he gives water to? Oh, down here the guy. So this guy is pale and will probably die in a second. This guy maybe still has some hope left. There's a guy on the table in the corner. He's probably one waiting for stitches. Um, wrong menu. Yeah. Um, but that won't work. Also. <laughs> yeah, this is just fucked. Um, need still need to be have more than stuff done. Um, and uh, yeah, we'll just wait for that. So I'll see you guys in a moment. And minor one one succumbed to infection. He died. Oh dear. Um, I'll have more in the future, but. Uh, Things are going good. Yeah, I'm having a whole lot of extra mushrooms. And I have the farmer going on, and uh, do I still have any food in containers? No. Why well, don't I have any extra food containers? Because I'm making tons of crafts. You know what? No crafts. I have enough. Make more pots, please. Um, I do actually have some coffins. Nice. Um. How is the ding going? I also start some new ding down here because uh, there's gold and I'll need more gold, gold, gold. Um, outside things are going fine too, uh, especially this level. It's actually starting to look like something. Um, uh, I was making a bridge there on the left side. It's uh, going to be made out of gold. It's ice waters with gold bridges and gold entrances. It's going to be something. Um, down here too, the walls continuing, and I'll need to place more, but also needs to have me more dug out. But um Yeah, that's working fine. Um let's see. What is Mr. Miner guy doing? Is he on break again? I bet he is. He's drinking. Um well I need to have enough to drink. Do I? Yeah, two hundred and how many food things? Oh, Talking about food, I do have enough, and um, I have more than enough chickens now. So let's turn on the hen stock egg stockpile again. There we go, and I have more than enough food by the looks of things here. Yeah, it's still too small for the stockpile, so uh, let's make some lavish meals. I'll have more than enough eggs later, so and I have the meat coming in from outside, so everything's fine. Uh, also, I made a farm with pigtails here, but it's the wrong season. Um, yeah, and uh, the farmer is doing way good, way too good at his job. There's so many rotting mushrooms, and he's planting them again already. Maybe, you know what, farmer, you're going to be digging too. Don't need to farm at the moment. There's so much extra things, extra plump helmets. You can be a miner for now. And we'll relieve the farming job for now. Later on I'll need it again or my drawers will die, but... Well, not die since I have eggs, but... Need more miners. Um, yeah, and... Um, well, let's see. Things are going fine here. Look at that. This almost continued. Well, we're done here. But... Uh, 
Well, need to continue all this. Um, what was I going to say? Say even. Um, something else I wanted to tell you guys, but sir, uh, it's completely slipped my mind. Oh dear. Um. Oh well, I'll find out. Also, what's this? By two minutes coal. Ugh. Yeah, that's some sort of economic rock. Also, I have gypsum, which means I can make plaster. Nice. Setting a uh, stockpile to uh, yeah, economic and obsidian can be a nice thing in your fortress since if your dwarves find the rock, they'll bring it here if it's important. Um, yeah, I'll guess I'll see the set them some plaster too. How uh, about uh, other things outside? Anything nasty outside yet? Little penguins. Little penguins. Little peas. No, aren't they cute? Um, small flightless bird. Little blue bird. Very blue penguin. Well, that's fine for them, but my hunter will probably kill them. But that's fine for me. <laughs> um, looks like it's forging comes to a stop too. Oh yeah, I actually made some copper stuffs in the meanwhile. Um, since in the future I'll also will be wanting to make um, a Mark's Dwarf squad, let's set up some of that and make some more crossbows, a copper crossbows, since that's the best I have for now. And um, yeah, let's make some more copper bolts too. And how's the glass forging doing? It's not running at all. That is a problem. Uh, let's collect more sand for now. Okay. And yeah, 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 I need thread for the sutures, but I won't ever get that. Um, finding damp stone under here, that's a problem. Down there? Hmm. Guess it's, there's an aquifer level, a level above this level. But, uh... Oh well, that's fine. Um, anyway. Oh yeah, they're digging out more, cancelling more. Guess I shouldn't build anything normally in this level, but for mining exploration it is fine. And anyway, anyway, I'll pause the video. <laughs> hey, this tile here actually got done. You know, one the one we start with in the video. Okay, uh, let's place a floor hatch over this one. So this dwarf, which is obviously got stuck, uh, can go outside again. And um, Weaponsmith is creating masterpieces, that's nice to know. Let's check that. Uh, Weaponsmith, what are you doing? Are you actually making those couple crossbows at masterpieces? Apparently you did. Nice. Um, Okay, so he's making masterpiece weapons, um, or something else, but I think that's fine, yeah, he has no job at the moment. Um, well, I need to give this more jobs, what do I have? I have 30 copper bars, um, how about starting off with some armor for whatever I get marks dwarves. Um, yeah, let's uh, add two of each for now. So, I'll make sure I have a good set of armor. Um, this will have to do for now. Unfortunately, he can't, isn't that good at armor, but he'll do something. Um, but the dwarf down there. That's dwarf down there. You help menu, you go away. Okay, this has been built now. Now, I should be able to do is use this to make a pit pond and throw something down there, like a chick. Which might actually survive the landing. Let's uh, throw four down while we're at it. And uh, that should not give a status error message. Yeah. Okay, so can't throw an animal down a downstairs pit. But you can throw them down a normal pit. And will that fall wash way too far? <laughs> you saw one chick falling or a couple. And uh, yeah, <laughs> splatter on landing. This place is splattered with bones now. Um, let's take a look at this log. <laughs> um, little penguin is fighting this, another penguin is a little chick. Um, 
You know, little penguin is getting killed by the hunter, and the hunter is hunting uh, with his bone bolts. Um, no combat report for the chick splattering on the ground. Oh well. Um, anyway, using this I can finally see a little bit deeper into the caves. Although not much. And I can still can't see the bottom. This is quite a cave. What was in the, what it called a deep pit for nothing. Um, yeah, I actually had a plan to like get a pit of cave for myself, but with these deep caves that will be a problem. Um, okay, um, well, I guess we'll just have to dig down some more ourselves and see. Maybe there's a nice point to dig down, like here. This doesn't seem to have any problems with any other levels. No. Getting closer now. And that's actually pretty close to my main stairway over here. Um, okay. This style, in the middle. Let's see if we can't use this to connect it to a fortress and let's connect it at um, at this level and use it downstairs again. Um, giving way to my many other dig commands but uh, well this at least is a single staircase and that will go fine. Yeah you go this deep, sure. Um, also, outside, where the yeah, major action is happening this episode is, uh, going fine. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm building way more walls out here, and it's actually starting to become, uh, uh, starting to look something like a fortress. Also, that gold bridge is done. Good. Need more later. It's, uh, just an example, so I should hook it up to leverage, but I'm trying to finish this wall first. Um... Let's see. Well, of course, they can't build on this little corner. Um, well, need more walls to be done and more stuff to be dug out. And uh, well, maybe end the video too. Maybe. Well, I'll do one more pause, and after that, we end the video. Okay, some things were done. Uh, I also noticed that I never actually set this dining room. Another error, which you'll probably comment on. Um, also, um, I was done with this little digging area with a channel of gold, and this area shall be my graveyard. I'll place the coffins here, and let's place uh, some coffins around already. Um, yeah, just place them next to the wall. So I think the dwarves need to be able to stand next to them and uh, not diagonally next, just regular next. Um, so to make that sure I'll remove this one. And uh, now we should have a whole lot of coffins for my dwarves. Um, yeah, and they'll actually some place now. Let's uh, use these for burial, all three of them. That will do some more stuff. Um, yeah, that will at least clean up the bodies at least. Also, I made some uh, more weapon. I made some weapon traps for the entrance, which I should have done way earlier too. Uh, outside, going fine. Um, coming closer to closing this off. Let's place another layer of walls now. Um, like this should be fine. Here too. Um, this will work. Yeah, your doors can stand. And, uh, you can build a wall like in floating air, at least as long as they can stand it down next to it, and then it is direct next to it, directly next to it even. Um, blah 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 blah. But this is moving on. Um, also, yeah, still no tread. <laughs> it is. It did manage to become spring, but um, yeah, I need to wait until summer until the pigtails will start growing. Um, that's fine. That little guy will be dead anyway. Um, yeah, these guys. No, 
how are you doing? Still has his leg hurting, this one. Still hurting too, and still on the table, needing to be... Yeah. Um, shoot shirt, even. Um, also, let's add a lot, couple more beds to the dormitory. Since we have some... Um, well, one more to make it sort of symmetrical. Um, that'll work. Yeah, let's see how the coffins are doing. Almost all built. Okay. And let's uh, allow a lot of them for burial. Um, so, yeah, now the dwarves have something somewhere to take the bodies, and um, well, that'll work out. Um, yeah, the stop level almost done. Okay, set one more pause. Now, I am going to end the video here. You'll see the completion of this in the uh, next quarters. And this will take ages for you. Everything's completed anyway. But uh, things are moving around and actually getting somewhere. Um, so, that will be the end of this episode. And I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys later.